What's up, y'all? We're back here with another Batman Arkham episode. Last time we left off, we were following Dr. Young to figure out where she was. And we actually made it into the office. Now, let me see what this Riddler Joker is here. Oh, Riddler Joker. Wow. What <laughs> this riddle is. Okay, we know about that one. Alright, so there's two riddles that we got. But, you know, we're sitting here again. We're gonna get this done today. I'm gonna do a triple upload. There we go. We're starting out good right now. Now, Joker's thugs were trying to get into that office. It looks like they couldn't get through the main door. Got to find a different way in. All right, Bruce. So I guess it's not there. <coughs> but uh, yeah, we're gonna be doing a triple upload today. Uh, I haven't figured out what the other two gameplays are going to be just yet. Well, one, I do know. But get ready. It's it's going to be a good one. Alright, so last time we went over Ray Shagul. I don't feel like I need to go over Ray Shagul again. What was... Oh, climb. It's just regular glass. All right, <clears throat> let's get this going. I got a new headset, so hopefully the sound quality is a little bit better than my other one. I got that PlayStation Gold headset, so we'll see how this works out, guys. Always check before you keep going. You never know what you may find. I don't have to think. <clears throat> Someone has already got to the safe. The only question now is, who opened it? No sign of forced entry. Whoever opened it knew the combination. Let's see. Good. Dr. Young got to her notes before Joker. She's taken them to hide somewhere. I need to follow her and find out where she put them. Ah, uh, first of all, I think this is the real black mask. She's too small. There we go. Character bio, black mask. <clears throat> Here we go. Let's see if I can get through this without stumbling, unlike the last episodes. Following the suspicious death of multimillionaire parents in a fire. Roman Sionis inherited the fortune and then went on a bankrupt, went on to bankrupt their company. Um, it's still early for me. Uh, saved by a buyout by Bruce Wayne, Sionis came to resent and hate Wayne. Fixated on the concept of mass, Sionis carved one from his father's black coffin and sought revenge. His ensuing battle with the Dark Knight caused his mask to be burnt into his skin, remaking him as the black mass. Sionis is now a feared gang leader and one of the most powerful mob bosses in Gotham with a burning hatred of the Batman. Yo, I'm going to tell you something about this. There is a Batman cartoon movie that I watched. Oh my God. Black Mask has one of the reactions in there where they tell him like, boss, he's too much. He's like, I'm not going to say what I normally say, but it, it's, it's a good one to watch though. Uh, Real names, Roman Sionis, occupation, professional criminal, base of operations, Gotham City, eyes brown, hair none, six feet, one inches, 
195 pounds. First appearance, Batman, number 386, August 1985. So, like I said, we already went over Ray Shagul last time. So just pull that out the way. All right, now. There we go. All of the hand printed. Oracle, I'm on Dr. Young's trail. I've had to calibrate the scanner to only show recent prints. If I follow these, I will find her or the notes. I hope it works. Just so you know, the GCPD found one of Joker's bombs downtown. It was full of marzipan and kittens. As I thought, it's just a twisted diversion. The real action's on Arkham. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I can't go through this. Oh, no, I can't. Okay. How do I unlock the door, though? Do I just... I'm going to have to go back through the vent. That's nice, Batman. Go back through the vent. Yeah. I heard water. Okay. I heard something over there. So... <clears throat> All right. He hit me in the back of the head. <sighs> Ain't gonna lie, they took me out guard. Alright, let's figure out where we're going. Got a tape here. What's the tape? Patient interview six. Dr. Crane has been back in custody for three weeks. Regular sessions have been inconclusive. I am not sure he is actually insane. Good evening, Stephen. How are you tonight? I'm conducting the session, Jonathan. Of course. If that helps you cope, I wouldn't have it any other way. Let's talk about the events three weeks ago. What did you think you'd achieve? Dr. Murphy is still in therapy. I wanted to understand him. His personal demons, his fears. It's all quite fascinating, really. But you are... were a respected doctor. A brilliant mind. Now just another resident in Arkham. Can I have a drink? A strong one? This kind of question bores me. I'm afraid not. Interesting choice of words, Doctor. Tell me. What are you afraid of? Scarecrow plays a big part in a lot of things with this Arkham series, man. That's just... I'm, I'm happy to go back and play these games, and now I got a record of them, and I'm going to organize a lot of different things with this series. Y'all bear with me. We're going to get through a lot of this. We'll do it together. Beat up earlier. Yeah, they're dead. Ah, oh, great. Here then. His 
stay here and keep a lookout for the bat or Zaz. Whatever else it is. I don't like this. I don't like it any more than you do. So, so what? We just wait here? The boss wants us here, so we stay here. I don't need two people in. Oh, it's funny, man. Only two people? Alright. Need to find it. Yo, like. What does a bird need in the rain? A penguin. 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 Character bio. All right, penguin cobble pop. <laughs> the penguin, one of Batman's oldest foes, is an eccentric criminal mastermind known as much for his love of ornithology and trick umbrellas as for his shady business dealings. Gotham's popular Iceberg Lounge serves as Cobblepot's front for a number of illegal financial activities that fund much of the city's underworld. Despite his short stature, the Penguin is a wily foe whose umbrellas conceal a variety of deadly weapons and gadgets. Real name, Oswald Chesterfield Cobblepot. My bad, my wife is in there doing something. It disturbed me. Base of operations, Gotham City, eyes, blue, hair, brown, height, 5'2", weight, 175. First appearance, Detective Comments, number 58, December 1941. Man, I remember watching that old... Ba that was the first Batman movie I've ever watched. was the one with Penguin. It's the old, old one. They had one with Eartha Kid playing Catwoman. Her name... Got him. Now, before we go in this next room, one, the hell is up here? Ah. Okay. And this puzzle. Literally appears out of thin air. Where is the dot? All right, Amadeus, let's see what you got to say. They brought the animal before me, shameless and barking like a mad dog. For what felt like days, I endured his boasts. He took pleasure recounting his actions, cataloging his depraved crimes. What should have been revenge turned to pity. This poor dog needed my help. Amadeus Occam is getting more and more interesting. Now, back to this, right here. Hmm. 
Why didn't I think? Why didn't I think? Wait a minute, uh, maybe I did think, hold on. Where would the dot be though? That's the question. Let me reassess this. Might even edit this part out. No, I got it. I'm a, I was right. I'm losing Thanks, Rosie. Do what, sir? Okay. Okay. My wife brought me my food, y'all. Sit this down. It's still piping hot. Let it cool for a little bit. Alright. We've got that part down packed. Let's go see Dr. Young. One more left. Congratulations! Now all you have to do is take a stroll downstairs and save the helpless ostriches. Right. Some fishing going on. get last time the twin did we get the twin battle rings last time y'all i can't really remember now let's see what we can get um we got the remote control Wait a minute. That's the next thing I think we need to get is a special combo because we got the remote control battle ring. We'll get the twin battle ring. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. So let's get these combos a little bit quicker. The next we'll go for another health boost 
And then the twin battle ring should be what we need to get. All right, let's go. Wait, what's that door? Something's weird again. Let's see. Yeah, I can't go in detective mode. We're back in one of Crane's nightmare gases. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely. I can't even run. Yep, it's fear toxin. I can't believe you insisted on sitting through that movie again, Bruce. Come on, we'll be late for Alfred. I'm sorry, Daddy. Go, you really don't. Alfred will wait. Keep up, Bruce. Where are you taking us? We can cut through here. But it's starting to rain. Bruce is tired. Can't we just wait for him here? Come on, keep up. We're nearly there. Mm. Turned into an alleyway. Had all started. Come on, kid, this way. Take a seat in my office. Is he okay? He'll be fine. A kid like that with all that money, he'll be just fine. Shut up, no. He's eight years old and all alone. Money will fix that. Whatever you say, Gordon. His butler's on his way to pick him up. You hear that? He's got a butler. I'm sorry. I just need to ask you some questions. Can I get you anything? You okay? I know you don't feel like answering me, but it's the only way to catch who did this. Let's get to it. You want to play like that? We can play.
what are you trying to do? Oh, wow. I could have went for it right then and there. Playing is conservative, but I see. Oh, uh, here we go again. I love these interactions with Crane, though. These nightmare modes. on that lane. It's locked. I need to find another way down.
Hmm. A game of cat and mouse can be painful. Catwoman. You try and get past me, Bats, and I will fry you! Come on, dude. Makes me sick. Character bio. Woo, Catwoman. A lot of folks like they had a beer at their pay. Alley beer, alley beer. All right. An orphan who learned to survive on Gotham City streets, Selena Kyle took to thievery to survive, but determined to do it in style. She learned martial arts and trained extensively to perfect her skills as a cat burglar. Her criminal activities are often tempered by a reluctant altruism, making her, incons making her an inconsistent villain and occasional hero. She regularly eludes capture by the Dark Knight and maintains a complicated and first her relationship with Batman that frequently turns her flirtatious and occasionally legitimately romantic. Ooh. Real name Selena Kyle, professional thief, Gotham City, green eyes, black, 57125. First appearance, Batman number one, spring 1940. Another OG. Another OG. Listen to me carefully. Help me! Please, help me! Come any closer, and I'll paint the room crimson with her blood. Go oh, shut up. All that ain't even necessary. Stop now. Sorry. I'm sorry. I saw Bane. I know. I, I, Joker threatened me. I wanted to stop the experiment. I tried to give him his money back. Joker doesn't take no for an answer. He wants an army, a horrible twisted force to destroy Gotham, but he couldn't do it without the formula. I hid it, but. So now he has Venom and your formula. God, he has gallons of the stuff. There's a lab. Hidden in the gardens. It's locked off, but the security key codes for the entire island are in the warden's safe. 
What else is Joker planning? How should I know? You think anything he says makes sense? I think he's insane. <laughs> oh my god! Get out of the way! <laughs> I needed that combo. these security gates before she died she told me there's a production plant hidden somewhere in the gardens the Wayne Tech security protocols seem to be hack proof we just did a good job it's a two-part biometric sequence apparently generated by the warden using a code sequencer and destroyed by Joker in the safe explosion Harley Quinn has the warden and he's the only chance we have to get past these gates okay good luck That doll, that freaking doll. Scarface. Character bio. <clears throat> Gotham's Blackgate Penitentiary once had a gallow tree from which 313 criminals with death sentences were hanged. The wood from the tree was whittled by an inmate into the puppet Scarface. And that inmate was murdered by Arnold Wesker, a man who will soon fall under Scarface's influence. While most believe that Scarface is simply a tool through which Wesker, as the criminal mastermind, the ventriloquist acts out a dark side of his personality, Wesker himself believes that Scarface is possessed by the souls who died beneath the gallows tree. And the puppet actually motivates him to commit the duo's many crimes. Real name Scarface. Professional criminal, Gotham City, black, black eyes, black hair, height, 2'6", 15 pounds. First appearance, Detective Comics, number 538, February 1988. Hmm. <laughs> You know what, we've rescued Dr. Young. I think I'm going to end it right here. So until the next episode, y'all, hit that like button, that subscribe button, that bell notification so that you know when I go live with another Batman video. Like I said, today we're doing a triple upload. This is one of three. I got two more to do. So stay tuned for that. And as always, 